every harvester begins its life at the foundry. In North America, a team of 500 people produce grey and ductile iron castings for engines and drivetrain components. Controlling the manufacturing allows us to produce larger, more complex castings with tight tolerances for specific agricultural applications. Every casting is documented with its own serial ID for traceability and then inspected for quality. Coordinate measuring checks the alignment and X-ray scanning verifies the material density to ensure it meets our durability standards. Employing almost 2,000 people, Harvester Works is the largest combined factory in the world. Smart tools, advanced paint processes and automated systems set new standards for quality and reliability. Exporting worldwide, it's home to John Deere's largest combine, the 100 ton per hour X9 series. In Europe, engines are built by our power systems division at Sahan in France. Employing more than 800 people, they have built over 2.5 million engines for off-road use. Working with the Harvester engineering team, they design engines with specific characteristics for each model. Over 5 billion operating hours using variable geometry turbochargers and exhaust gas recirculation gives them valuable insights into engine performance. This expertise ensures customers benefit from lower emissions, the best possible fuel efficiency and ultra-low DEF consumption. Specialist drivetrain components for harvesters are built by John Deere Iberica near Madrid. 1,300 employees produce more than 150,000 transmissions and gearboxes every year, including the ProDrive automatic transmission for combines and self-propelled harvesters. Working closely with the engine team at Sahan and the development engineers at Zweibrücken, they are able to optimize the drivetrain for maximum power efficiency. At Stadlohn in the north of Germany, Kemper produce row-independent drum headers up to 9 meters and pickups for forage harvesters. Employing around 300 people, they have developed innovations such as stalk busting technology, which reduces pest infestation and improves mulching. Kemper products are also chosen by other brands of harvesters, and the company supplies around one in two of every rotary drum header sold worldwide. Further south at the Brookside plant, cabs are built. Over 700 employees produce more than 30,000 cabs a year for combines, foragers and tractors. Built with strong tubular frames for rigidity, there are thousands of different combinations to meet individual customer requirements. The front glass is robotically bonded using special sealants to ensure excellent sound insulation. Electronics are a key component of cabs, and these are produced in-house by the Electronics Solutions Division. Based at locations in the United States, Mexico and India, more than 1,000 people design, test and manufacture electronic components which are rugged enough to withstand the severe environments, heavy vibration, mud, dirt and rain of agricultural use. These include advanced communications technologies such as the Starfire receiver, in-cab displays, as well as engine control units. By building everything ourselves, it provides better integration of the harvester's CAN bus with cellular and satellite positioning signals. Computer software is also becoming increasingly important as operators digitally transform their farms.
A team of more than 200 data analysts, programmers and engineers develop software applications for location tracking, machine monitoring and job management. They are also responsible for the Operations Center, a cloud-based platform that securely stores machine and harvest data for mobile working and precision farming. Everything comes together here in Zweibrücken, where 1,100 people complete the final assembly. All the different parts, engines, transmissions, axles, cabs and electronics are delivered using just-in-time logistics. This ensures each sub-assembly is timed so that it meets the harvester chassis at exactly the right point. And a new harvester is born. <laughs>